the PharmaFlight International Science and Service Center is Hungary's first comprehensive teaching and research and development resource for the aviation industry. Students from 28 countries around the world attend our courses. Detailed professional training in theory is followed by sophisticated practical instruction based on our specialized and modern technology. We have the latest medical equipment and aviation simulators at our disposal, and our staff consists of professionals with first-rate experience on both the practical and the theoretical sides. Julia Jury is the founder of Pharma Flight's training program and scientific center and head of research. Formerly Director General of Hungary's National Transportation Authority, he is currently Head of the Department of Aeronautical Engineering at the University of Debrecen. Jula Jury is also a fully qualified pilot of the Boeing 737 aircraft. Our goal at PharmaFlight is to aid the workers in the highest professional requirements like aviation ground control, air crew, and other constantly paramount efficient experts to reach and maintain optimal physical and mental condition and to handle unexpected events professionally. At PharmaFlight, since the 1980s, we've been developing a simple, non-invasive physiological assessment method that helps our clients and their employees to get the best performance out of their lives, both short and long term. The individual test results tell clients how to reduce the risk of fatigue and maintain their own optimal physical and mental health. Our knowledge base includes data from over 300,000 measurements, which have been successfully applied in the road transportation and aviation industries. We use a standardized resting measurement protocol for every client. This way, we try to eliminate the differentiating causes of individual lifestyle and activity patterns, and also differences in circadian rhythms. Clients are asked not to do any physical activity on the days of the measurements, and the assessing room is a separated, quiet, and temperature-controlled space, where the temperature is normally maintained at around 22 degrees Celsius. The measurement takes place in a supine position for six minutes. There is no tasks involved, so the measurement can be done several times. The client is therefore not able to manipulate the test results in any conscious way. The main focus during these resting evaluations is to get a clear picture and an objective database of the monitored person's physiological state that includes the level of stress, surfeit, cardiovascular and respiratory state, peripheral nervous system, and sleep efficiency. The results of the resting measurement tests are time-stamped and cross-checked, giving great detail and accuracy. It is important to note that our tests are not medical level tests. The goal is not to diagnose disorders but to see deviations from the optimal physiological status. We do the assessment of the cardiovascular status. This test gives a clear picture about vascular functions, possible dysfunctions, heart rate, blood pressure, vascular stiffness, cardiovascular risks, and these are all related to sedentary work and considerable stress and workload. This method uses an invasively validated, non-invasive oscillometric tool that is quick and it can be used as a submedical level screening test for larger populations. Rest and workload affect muscles, breathing, digestion, thermoregulation, cardiovascular system, and so on, creating changes in line with the alternating demands. These changes can be well monitored by monitoring the autonomous nervous system. Our method of doing this is using HRV, heart rate variability, so we get objective and scalable data on the heart and the peripheral nervous system function. We also monitor the relaxing capacities of the brain. During this examination, 
we use a dry electrode EEG device, which is capable of monitoring the electric signals of brain cells, hemisphere dominance, stress, focus, brain dynamics, and the autogenic status. Our resting evaluation also includes the examination of muscle oxygen consumption and metabolism tracking. Here, we get a clear picture about muscle metabolism, capillarization, oxygen consumption, and glycogen deposits by using a so-called NIRS technology, which stands for Near Infrared Spectroscopy. Our goal is to gain a better understanding of individual differences in physical status and stress tolerance. The PharmaFlight methodology is being used by Hungarian police SWAT teams at the application and intake stage to ensure the suitability of trainees for this very demanding and specialized work. Thanks to our testing, the training period has been reduced by 50% from 36 months to 18 months. Prior to my appointment, I took part in a theoretical and practical training at PharmaFlight, which lasted roughly one and a half year. During this time, I gone through several medical examinations. These painless uh, medical examinations are useful to get to know how you really are, how to plan uh, your rest time, how to maintain your mental abilities and manage the stress. So these are my experiences with the medical examinations at PharmaFlight. PharmaFlight means enhanced safety level and reduced inefficient investment for hunger control. While technology has dramatically been improved to serve safety goals since the beginning of this century, human risk and fatigue is still a serious issue in global aviation industry. PharmaFlight represents a brand new approach by mapping the physiological condition of humans, in our case air traffic controllers, instead of recovery focus, one size fits all type of legacy approaches. Measuring fitness, and rostering only fit at close to their working stations will further enhance the human-related safety level of air traffic services at Hungara Control. We at PharmaFlight have been using our testing system internally for many years. The resting physiological assessment test can be taken remotely anywhere in the world and is fully customizable to client needs. One application of particular interest is using our assessment methodology in situations where long-term training is required to reach peak performance for a specific but relatively brief time period. For example, it can be used by athletes who need to perform at their best in time-limited competitions, such as the Olympics and other world championships. The PharmaFlight assessment methodology can also be used for clients where the performance goals are long-term balanced efficiency. For example, long-haul truck drivers. Because the results of our testing can be used during the selection and initial training process, the screening phase is shorter and more efficient and the number of dropouts can be reduced. Many industries whose employees include a high proportion of skilled workers doing routinized tasks are finding that their workforce demographics are trending toward retirement age. Our assessment technology can be used to enhance and prolong task efficiency among this cohort. 